It's a little warm out there. We're talking about jockeys 10 furlong race for correct answer with one, then two, then three, then four, etc., etc. And let's go down to the field. Here we go. I'm going to read a question, give you three choices. You have five seconds to enter that answer on that old keypad. Don't do nothing. You can see the three like buttons on the screen and fill in the missing number. All right, boys and girls and cats and kiddos, horses are in the starting gate, ready to go, and they're off. And here's your first question with one furlong. If you're competing against Andre Agassi at Wimbledon, how many sets must you win in order to win the match? Two, three, or five? Three. I would just like to compete against him for his wife. Isn't he married to, uh, Brooke Shields? Yes, the correct answer is three. And who gave it to me? Joe, Robert, and Jason. The bottom three guys are moving out. One furlong lead. Second question worth two. And here it comes. When a reporter asked Marilyn Monroe what she wore at night, she once replied, Chanel number what? One, two, or yeah. five? I don't know. She just said, I don't want to do that. That's bloody. The correct answer is five. Chanel number five. And who got that? Alan, James, Robert, and Jason. And Joe went out and bought the wrong perfume. So in the lead go Robert and Jason. And next question is worth three furlongs. This is a good horse race here again. After his 1989 Iran Contra trial, Oliver North was sentenced to how many years probation? Zero, two, or six? Whatever it was, it was not enough. <laughs> Okay, correct answer is two, and Alan, Joe, and Robert. So we got a good race here. Robert's in the lead, followed by Alan, then Joe close behind, then come Jason and James. Look at this. Look, this is a perfectly symmetrical horse race. Beautiful. Next question is worth four furlongs. Here it comes. The leading tower of Pisa is how many stories high? Four, six, or eight? Don't okay. try to climb it, though, because you'll fall right in your toughest. Believe me. And the, the answer is eight. And Robert is moving out. Look at the little green guy. Robert's moving out. He's moving out. Will he fall closely by Alan? Robert. Congratulations, Robert. You're great race. In a little while, you're going to play a triple crown for a chance at that wonderful washer, uh, uh, wonderful dishwasher, that is. And for all you other jockeys, you're going to receive a GSN phone card. See, I told you, Alan, you're going to get something here. Thanks for playing the trivia track. And now, uh, just cool off. Have a good Christmas Eve. And uh, we'll be back to play triple crown right after these messages. Stay here.